Peace and love. My name is Tierra Chardet. Welcome to my channel. I thank you so much for subscribing and liking my videos. I truly appreciate it. This video is for my lovely water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. You won second place for the most views behind air signs, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. So this video is for you. Shout outs to you. Um, before we hop into it, you can click the link in the description box for my website. You're still able to get a free follow-up reading when you schedule your first reading. That ends January the 6th. You can catch me here Monday through Friday for your divine message for the collective. And on Fridays, we do a weekend forecast so make sure you check that out. Also, these energies fluctuate, so you can still watch the other videos and it may still resonate. Maybe your rising is in um, Virgo, but uh, this video is for love and romance, so you're gonna wanna check your Venus sign. So if you have a Leo, if your Venus is in Leo, you're gonna wanna check that fire sign, okay? Um, so I think that's all there is. So let's get into it, water signs. So it looks like many of you are starting a new relationship or a relationship has just started. Um, it's in its first stages. It's something that is bringing you some happiness, some contentment. So shout outs to those who, who that resonates with you. Congratulations. I also feel like in this love message, children play a huge factor. Whether it's kind of being a buffer between you and somebody else. Like maybe you can't really get to this person because of children or... Um, you just, you both, you or this person has children or something like that. But I am seeing children are a huge, um, situation in your love life. So congratulations to those that applies to because children are lovely. Um, and for many of you, it's literally you're in the beginning stages of a romance or romance is on the way to you. So water signs, it looks like you guys, um, also had a couple things occurring in love i'm thinking of the the air signs as well so water signs you had a couple situations going on as far as love um you know in the collective message messages from last week there was a lot of you know betrayal infidelity just a lot of things going on you know stuff happens and mistakes have happened so it's many of you um water signs are moving out of that energy if this was done to you you might have broken up with this person completely cut ties with them um if you have been doing this it's like you forget forgiven yourself you realized you know what you have what you did whatever that may be however it applies to you and you you're trying to move forward now again this is for entertainment purposes only so don't let any of these messages or any other message really um override your own intuition and common sense so take that for what it is and also these energies fluctuate so this could be you or the other person and also if this doesn't have to resonate right now this could resonate later or this may have already happened to you okay so with love there was a need water sign for you to be strong okay to be tough with yourself maybe and stern with how you've been going about things as far in, in your romantic life um, or this could be you needing to be firm in what you're what you want for love and separating yourself where that applied I see that as well you needed to find your inner strength um, in certain situations love may have kept you up all night you know maybe you've been crying or you've been seeking assistance from your guides or you know writing in your diary or journal um, and I also do I see I just felt that um creative pursuits so maybe you really dived into your work um maybe you started writing poetry or music or maybe you're into spiritual practices like yoga or dance um you know things like that I'm feeling like you you took a detour and you kind of got out of your emotions and you dove into your creative expression like you put whatever traumas or emotions or anything like that, you put it into your work, okay? Which is, you know, sometimes that creates the best art, really, when we do that. So, you know, however you were able to deal with what happened to you and it's for your benefit, I'm with you on that, okay? So you, you went through a period of healing, okay? Also, for many of you water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, you've had people come in trying to lend you a hand. Oftentimes, you may have, you know, 
push them off politely like no I don't really need help I don't need assistance but at some times you really did need somebody to talk to or just you know somebody to share a laugh with so you allowed people into your life which I commend you for that's that's amazing um and you were able to you know with the people around you and with your own passion you were able to move out of a situation of feeling hurt or depressed or feeling like you're you you missed out on the love that you were wanting because I feel like a lot of you may have been wanting someone or had been in love with someone and it wasn't um it wasn't balanced for you that person didn't really return all the emotions and you know that's okay you know things happen like that there's somebody out there for you there's somebody out there for them so I always like to keep that in mind okay um so you you've had to move past that situation excuse me um and I also feel like that's divinely guided and that's similar to the um the air signs many of you guys may have some air sign placement so I would check out that video um many of you had to have this period of healing and it was it was a spiritual thing you had to go through this time alone or this time of you know maybe even chaos to really show you yourself and what you want and the situations you were engaging yourself in the people you were having around you so i also feel like this was um really rooted in spirituality as well and many of you guys really stood firm you made a decision look at the dogs going at it for the, uh the children out there <laughs> So I feel like you guys really had um, a lot going on and you made a clear cut decision to break free from it. You spoke up for yourself, you stood up for yourself and you decided, okay, this isn't working for me. How I've, have, how I've been behaving hasn't been working for me. Let's try something new. Let's, um, you know, redirect this thing. And many of you have, like I said, many of you physically parted ways with people, places, situations that weren't working for you. Some of you actually, you know, changed your number or you you know you went in a totally different direction and kudos to you you know for taking a stand on what you want not many people can do that so I want to say that to you um, if this is new love coming in for you water signs I really want to say you know congratulations you put in the work you've I'm feeling like earned it maybe that's not the quite the right word but you guys really put in the work to heal and you have new love coming on um on the way because of that or you're able to reignite emotions in your current relationship or pour that love into yourself many of you water signs I feel like that's exactly what you're doing and good for you okay so that is your romance uh video water signs for January 2019 I hope you enjoyed it please like the video and if it resonated with you leave that in the comment section you can still catch me here Monday through Friday for your divine message for the collective and pay attention to Friday because that is your weekend forecast. Also, these energies fluctuate and this is a love video. So you're going to want to check your um, where your Venus is and watch that video, Earth, Air, Fire or Water Signs. OK, watch that video. If you are unsure about this whole astrology thing, you can still contact me through my website. The link is in the description box. I do birth chart reports, so you could definitely come to me and I can help you out. OK, um, and so that is all peace and love.